please. Okay, my name is Vidyam. I'm a, um, a writer, an artist, and a researcher. And very recently, I've started a publishing project which aims to bring out um, more comic books, whether in the form of singles or anthologies. So we've done one single and we've done one anthology, and we're doing another anthology on a non-fiction narrative set in India. I've heard your fascinating story yesterday of why comics and things yeah, like that. Yeah. So, you know, the big debate was, is this uh, happening in India or is it just a Western trend that uh, we could make happen here? But of course, supply creates its own demand also. Right, yeah. Um, with regard to comics, um, I think somebody in the, the panel on Pulse on Publishing said that uh, we are a very visual culture. So, True. I can personally say that uh, through my own... Uh, I, I do a lot of research into storytelling traditions and several of those combine image and words. So it's not a necessarily written word, it's spoken word, but there is a precedent of a lot of uh, image and word based storytelling media. So in that sense, I don't think it's necessarily entirely a Western concept. True. True. Uh, we have had uh, a long history of comics as well. Even though that idea of comics itself and the medium might have been imported, there's uh, similar mediums have existed in the past, True. if you look at... Pat What's your own background? It's art or uh, sociology? My, actually, or? no, I study journalism. I see. Yeah, yeah. And how did you go to the visual side of it? Um, I actually studied, um, uh, as part of my journalism degree, I did a, a thesis on Joe Sacco's work as a comics journalist, wow. because he identifies himself as a comics journalist. Wow. So I was very interested as a journalism student then to see uh, what are the parameters of journalism that he applied to comics and how does that work? Um, so that's how I got And it. your publishing is how old now? Um, uh, publishing actually is just about um, a year or so. Great. It's not, you have it's, to start, I mean everyone starts. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's, quite, it's quite small. I don't even know how long it will run for. I, I started seven years back. He's coming, Queenie. Yeah. You told him to wait here. Tom, yeah. Tom. Tom is checking out and coming. <laughs> okay, Tom is checking out and coming. I just started seven years back and I've yeah. been a journalist all my life and okay. uh, yeah you know and somewhere you have to start small and then you start yeah. enjoying it so I think you should keep going at it. Yeah it's... What I are mean, the biggest challenges you're facing? The biggest challenge is, is to I mean um, one of course uh, the funds is I guess it's a challenge everybody so it's not worth mentioning. Um, the other challenge would be uh, since most of it is creator driven um, how to manage the distribution <laughs> and the okay. and manage the artist no, no i mean you are yourself the artist okay. so how do you manage yourself okay okay, okay. when okay. on a daily basis you have to get back to people about right. <laughs> distribution and getting things into stores right. it's not something that you train yourself to do yeah. most, most of the time you just train yourself to produce work so this is a i mean this is why when they were talking about uh, self publishing eating into markets i was confused because the entire process is so exhausting i don't see authors being able to sustain it beyond the point if you you know if you want to see yourself as an author more than a publisher um, so what's your label and uh, the name of the books uh, so my uh, my publishing project is called Captain Bijli Comics um, I try to keep it something catchy and because <laughs> it's, it's comics that, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, and we have two titles so far one is Mice Will Be Mice which is a small singles we wanted to experiment with singles format in India doesn't seem to work uh, anthology the second one is an anthology which has worked much better on dogs and as I said the upcoming Anirudh, 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 Annie Rudd Annie Rudd Annie yeah, 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 they're friends of ours yeah. okay okay yeah, yeah so they're part of the Goa writers as well so he went and liked all the photos which I had clicked on oh, Facebook. You were, yeah, yeah, oh, yeah. you were at the Yeah, at the yeah, launch? I was at the... At the oh. No, 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 not at the launch, at uh, the discussion yesterday. Oh, okay. Including one of the bag and, and all. He liked all of them. So I was wondering <laughs> why he was liking them. It struck me. So yeah. they worked together. Yeah, he did some launches for us in... They're very creative. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Yeah. With, a, with an IIT degree in aeronautical engineering, you should be. He has an IIT degree in... in aeronautical engineering. Not really. Anirudh, Anirudh. Really? Yeah. Oh, wow. So that's what we are always pulling his leg about. <laughs> this, is, this is what you did to end up in People journalism. Find out. No, it's it's fine. It's fine. I have no problem with that. Yeah, I think I think yeah. you know what we do, what we learn, and what we want to do with our lives are two Completely totally different. Yeah, different things. Yeah. yeah. And Even um, Rakesh, I think, is a, a master's in math. Rakesh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Now he's uh, turning black. So, who are your role models within India or outside? Um, in terms of. Publishing houses or, or publishing in terms of artists, houses. yeah. Or, I mean, I honestly see myself more as an artist than a, okay. than a publishing house. Okay. But publishing houses whose work I admire, uh, definitely Tara Books. 
they they work at in, fine in the comic medium yeah they work okay. in okay. comics okay. as well okay. so tar- not not uh, i think there are two tara books yeah There's, north and south yeah yeah so the one that's based in chennai works a lot for traditional artists to kind of bring them into the fold of publishing and adapt traditional yeah. media to publishing i see um and that i think since now they're entering the space of traditional artists giving talking giving their own biographies uh, it kind of changes the kind of content that one sees in publishing it's not just a certain class of people who are generating and delivering content now right. it's it's right. changing through initiatives like that so i find that quite uh, inspiring thank you so much and yeah. all the best thank you